But um, yeah, we are back again. Uh, last week, last time we checked, I almost died, which is kind of funny. Um, that box was what almost killed me. But uh, yeah. So as usual, I'm just gonna start us right off by going right at the same time. Maybe not. <laughs> Let's go up instead. I don't really want to run into them straight away. It's a fishing rod. Affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yes. All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me. Here's my number. You decide not to call. You send the line back out. Can I take it again though? Reel it in? Yes. It's a weird looking monster. Here's my number. You decide not to call. Okay, let's just send the line back out. We'll just leave it. <sighs> so as I was saying about Undyne... I love Papyrus' theme. Sans! Oh my god! Is that a human? Yes, yes I am. I mean, no, no I'm not. Uh, Actually, I think that's a rock. Oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god. Is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! 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 <clears throat> Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Len? Len? I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Ho oh, ho, he's got jokes. Now where did that rock go? Well, I didn't go anywhere, I guess. Anyone here? There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observed a well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. Nope, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. Oh. Ice cap struts into view. Let's check him out, shall we? They have 11 attack, 4 defense. This team wonders why it isn't named Ice Hat. Where's your hat? Oh god. Again, proving how bad I am. Maybe I shouldn't be using the D-pad. Uh, let's compliment. You inform Ice Cap that it has a great hat. Duh, who doesn't know? Oh, yeah, D-pad's way easier. Way easier, I say. The steel. You tried to seal their hat, but it's not weakened enough. I knew it! Thief! Down, up, down, up. Ooh. It's snowing dandruff. You know what? Since you're so obsessed with your hat and everything, I'm just going to ignore you. You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. Hello? My hat's up here. No, I don't care anymore. Oh, what was that? Ice Cap is sleekly checking if you're looking at its hat. No, I don't care. You can see you not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems defeated. Fine. I don't care. Oof. Ice Cap is desperate for attention. Well, I don't care. Mercyed. Oh wow, 13 gold. Can't believe how much we got messed up already. Um, I'm gonna quickly go back and save. <laughs> oh no. Well, what does this one do? Let's check you out. This teen comedian fights to keep a captive audience. Ice to meet you. Oh. 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 
Snow Drake is assessing the crowd. Um, laugh. You laugh at Snow Drake's pun. See, laughs. Dad was wrong. Oh Jesus! What are these attacks? He's pleased with its cool joke. Oh, there we go. We can mercy. Bye bye. Quick. <laughs> I'm on very low health. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Save. Did that give me my health back? Yes, it did. There we go. Yeah, I'm, ju I'm just going to flee from you. You weren't fun. You took forever to fight. Do, 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 do. Oh, well, we could just do this one. Laugh. You laugh at Snowdrake before it says anything funny. What are you laughing at? I'm laughing at you. Snowdrake is assessing the crowd. Heckle. <laughs> you tell them that they aren't funny. Is your flesh rotten as you? Oh. Can I mercy you yet? Let's joke with it then. You make a bad ice pun. Is that supposed to be funny? I am so bad at this game. Snowdrake is practicing its next pun. Well, let's just check then. Better not snowflake out. Just hide down here. Right, now we can laugh. There we go, now we can laugh. You have good taste in jokes. Uh, about here, maybe? Yeah, so the bottom right corner seems best for fighting Snowdrake. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm going to forget like in like two minutes. Absolutely no moving. Ooh, what you going to do? Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Pet the dog. It's too sus suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Should we just try not moving? Why was that blue? Dog old cat seems to find anything. Why was that blue, love? Easily excited by movements. Hobbies include squirrels. Will it move this time? I mean... Does the blue mean you can't move otherwise it'll hit you? Let's pet the dog. Oh, look at that. What? I've been pet! Pet, 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 pet. Doggo has been pet. Let's pet the dog again. Where's that coming from? <laughs> Help! I've been pet! Let's mercy you. You won. Oh wow, 30 gold. Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm going to need some dog treats for this. And away he goes. Hello? Hello, is anybody there? No? Huh. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Oh, I thought I could give them to him. Never mind. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see blue, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an way, easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop, stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Why did you colour it in yellow, then? No, no, what? <laughs> Remember the red stop signs? Well, think of them as blue, but I'm going to speak in yellow. Remember, blue stop signs. And now it's in white. Oh my god, ice puzzle. Yes. Take me back to the days of Pokemon. North, ice. South, ice. West, iced. And you guessed it, east? Oh, snowed in town. 
Ah, nice. <laughs> Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveller, please. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Sure. Thank you. Good luck. You're my friend now. We're having soft tacos later. Whee! Goodbye, little snowman. I will take... What is it? Snowman piece. Info. He has 45 HP. Please take this to the end of the earth. I shall do just that. I won't fight you. How did San... Actually, no. Why would I wonder if San's got in front of me? I disappeared. <coughs> You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh ho, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, the orb will administer a hearty sap. Sounds like fun. Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay. You can go ahead now. Um, Papyrus? Are you okay? Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Don't worry, I can brute force this puzzle. <laughs> I can brute force it. Uh, this way, maybe? Go that way. Incredible, you slippery snail! <laughs> Did you not see me get electrocuted like 15 times? You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be so easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. Yeah. Um. Oh. Oh. I guess just holding the arbor electrocuted me. Hey. Thanks. My brother seems to be having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Sure. Oh, hello. I don't understand why they aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice, nice cream? Okay. It's a frozen treat that warms your heart. Just 15G. Yeah, I'll take some. Here you go, have a super duper day. You've got a nice cream. Can I have another piece? It's a frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15G. I will take two. Have a super duper day. Thank you. How much does this heal? Heals 15 HP. Instead of a joke, the rapper says something nice. Oh. Oh. Kick. Did that get smaller? Oh, it's getting smaller. I think. Um, one second, and there it goes. Oh, yeah, I was actually waiting to see. So let's kick it about, shall we? Where do I have to get it to? Go. Go. Oh, no. Go. Down. Down. Oh, my God. <laughs> right, now, down. Down again. The hole is right there. Come on. No. No. Come on. Down. See, even in games I can't play sports. Kick. 
Oh my god, I got it. Purple. Even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of ball. You are awarded 2G. <gasps> There's a camera hidden inside this lump of snow. There you go, what? Okay. Hey, Sans. I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? Just 5G. Did I say 5? I meant 50. Yeah, sure, why not? Really? How about 5,000? No. I have to pay for the raw materials somehow. Um, Sans, I think your material cost is a uh, nil. It's like your product is right here. Whatever. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. My god. Amazing. Right. How does Sans keep getting ahead of me so easily? And now he's here! Hello? I wonder what happens if I actually say 5,000. 50,000? Yes. What? You don't have the money? Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. Fair enough. <laughs> smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowman. White rating can become yellow. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy. Blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans. Green rating. Destroy at all costs. Why is it in red? <laughs> His. Hers. Oh my god. I found an Overwatch couple in Undertale. Whatever shall I do? Okay, on to the next part. Human! I hope you're ready for... Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Oh, I can actually move. Okay, Monster Kids Word Search. Hey kids, can you solve this puzzle? I mean... Gaius Fabababada is at the very top. I will not... <laughs> this is actually hurting my eyes. I can see Monster in the middle. Um. Anyway. Oh my god, I got past it. Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion... Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Oh, it's gotta be the. The Jumble, sure. Ha ha ha, yes. Humans must be very intelligent if they also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> Thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Hey, those things are hard. Oh. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold it's stuck to the table. What's this? It's a note from Pirates. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. Little do you know, that spaghetti is a trap, designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it, that you won't realise you aren't progressing. Probably japed again by the great Papyrus. Nyeh! <laughs> Papyrus. Oh, it's a little mouse again. Can we use the microwave? It's an unplugged m Never mind. Of all the settings, all of the settings, say spaghetti. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. Oh, let's continue on, shall we? Warning. Dog marriage. Not sure what that means. Uh. Oh. Oh. Never mind. A lesser dog approaches. Pet the dog. You barely lifted your hand and lesser dog gets, got excited. 
Yes. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, that's very cute. The barking excited me. Pet the dog. Wait a minute. You lightly touched the dog. It's already overexcited. Oh, don't move, and then move. Oh my god, its head goes up. You pet the dog. It raises its head up to meet your hand. Ow. It's barking excitedly. Pet the dog. It's It was a good dog. It is a good dog. It's the best dog there is. Pet the dog again. You pet the dog. Its excitement knows no bounds. I've got to stop using the thumb set. Pet the dog. Critical pet. Dog excitement increased. Excited noises. Pet the dog. You have to jump up to pet the dog. Smoke was revving. Pet the dog. You don't even pet it. It gets more excited. Pet the dog. There's no way to stop this madness. Pet the dog. It enters the realm of the clouds. Pet the dog. You call the dog, but it's too late. It cannot hear you. Far away bark. Pet the dog again. Oh my god, its head's coming down. Pet the dog again. You can reach lesser dog again. Bark. Pet it again. You pet the lesser dog. And again. You pet lesser dog. Who's a good boy? Who's the best boy? It's you. Oh yes, pet the dog. You pet lesser dog. Look at its tongue going. Pet the dog again. Oh look at its tail as well. Pet the dog. Oh I don't think it can go anymore. Oh no it can. It's possible that you may have a problem. No no no, it's the best dog ever. Pet the dog. It's possible you may have a problem. Yeah but pet the dog. I don't care about that, pet the dog. <laughs> okay, we'll mercy now. It's fun. Good boy. Best dog ever. Right, let's clean this out. What's this? Well, it's clearly a map, so you come in, and then in between three items, there's an X. But it looks like a building. Oh well, let's go up. So in between three items there's a... Is it this? There's a switch! Click! Oh well, that wasn't really as exciting as I thought it would be. But that dog love. Oof. Best dog ever. Oh, here we go. Oh my god, there's more dogs. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Oh. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! Oh, they assault me. Uh, pet. The dogs are too suspicious. Pause off, you smelly human. That's not your husband, okay? Oh. Aha! The dogs are re-evaluating your smell. Um, sniff. The dogs sniff you again, but you smell just as weird as before. Hmm, what's that smell? So if I just stay here, I wonder if um. Oh wow! I am so I am so big brain. The dogs keep sniffing their axes to protect each other. Oh! If I roll around, I'll get rid of my smell. Let's do it. You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Let's kick human's tail. Do humans have tail? Oh, they just gave a kiss. So as long... Oh, no. Never mind. I was like, so as long as I don't move, I should be okay. <laughs> the dogs really want to re-smell you. Re-sniff. They sniff you again. After rolling around in the dirt, you smell all right. <gasps> what smells like... Actually, are you a little puppy? Oh, God. 
Oh god. How am I supposed to survive that? The dogs think that you are a lost puppy. Pet. You pet dog. Wow, pet by another pup. Wait, don't leave me out. How am I supposed to survive this? Um, let me eat an ice cream. Number two, Nuzzle Champs 98. Of course we were second. Oops. Right, let's pet this dog. Pet. You pet the dog wrestler. What about me? A dog that pets dogs? It's amazing. Oh, I figured it out. I figured it out. I got it. I got it. The dog's minds have been expanded. Oh, I can spare them both. Spare. Oh, so it does work. If they're both able to be mercied, um, you can actually just spare them both. That's a bit of a throwback to the other episode where I was curious. Well, I figured it out. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has opened for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Ah, Good dogs. But yeah, going back um, like the previous episode, I want to thank someone from episode one because they mentioned to me that you can actually spare bosses. So being able to actually, you know, not have to fight anyone at all. It's kind of how I want to play this game at first. So if you're somehow clicking this, go back to episode two or three and you'll see the conclusion of that. Or, you know, start from the beginning. It's up to you. But let's click this. Oh, maybe not. Let's click that. Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. How do I do that? Oh. That's that. Oops. Right, got it. Do that. Go this way. Go up. Go this way. And kapow. Oh my god, it's papyrus. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? I ate it. Really? Wowee! No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not human, I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. Hehehe, <laughs> nyeh. See, the thing is, I do actually enjoy pasta, so if that wasn't frozen, I'd probably make myself eat it. Wait for me, Papyrus. Hello again. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Nyeh! Are you just... You've just given up on me now, haven't you? Oh, maybe not. Human! Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow falls to the ground. Now the solution is different, and as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human. Look at my majestic flowing cape. I, the great papyrus, We'll solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. Okay. Oh, I messed up. I messed up again. Honestly, I messed up on the same one. Oh, got it. No, I haven't. Damn it. Right. So it seems to be that one that's messing me. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Nope, that'll be bad. Hmm. Wait, I figured it. If I go from here and go this way and then that way and now down up 
around like all the way around do 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 bop ha 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 how's that great papyrus wow you solved it and you did it all without my help incredible i'm impressed you must care about puzzles like i do well i'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then it might even be too easy for you yeah Wait for me, Papyrus. What was the... Oh, right, that's why. Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Oh, it just says the same thing. Well, bye then. How? How? Oh, here's this funky music again. It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see, these tiles, once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow are electric. They will electrocute you. Green are alarms. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange are orange scented, obviously. They will make you smell delicious. Blue are water. Swim through it if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also sap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Of course. I don't understand. There's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. Yeah. Get ready. All I have to do is wait. It's gonna break, isn't it? <laughs> oh wow, the red tiles really are impossible. I mean, technically it was a puzzle that's never been seen before. Actually, that's spaghetti from earlier. Wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. The machine isn't working. Fair enough. Oh my god, look, it's just like a dog. It's the broken head of a snow dog. Seems like the base of a snow dog. It's the base of a snow dog. It's the broken head of a snow dog. A wear of dog, please pet. On the floor inside is a box of pomer pomer raisins. Okay. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. Save. Nice. A dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But, as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until... It was rather sad to watch, but I couldn't turn away. I'm guessing they broke. Well, thank you. Oh, same again. So, boop. Boop. It's a lump of snow with the word sand written on it. It's a snow papyrus. Okay. Maybe from this direction instead. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. Don't tell me we're going to get this for a second try. Hey! Maybe, oh wait, maybe that's why it actually does that. So, if you try like how I did, and you basically fail straight away, like I did, you can then have the solution kind of forced upon you, if that makes sense. 
You know, like, oh, since the top didn't work, go to the bottom and try it that way. Haha, <laughs> it's snow. It's a snow puff. Woof. Oh. What a tiny doghouse. <gasps> Why's that snow got a tail? Oh, look at it. I am such a sucker for animals. You're a lot bigger than I thought, my guy. Oh, never mind. Dun, dun, dun. Wait, I thought this was... um. I've heard this song before. Well, I've heard remixes of it. Because um, I actually have it on a playlist from years ago. But I swear it said Tem Shop. Oh, well. I'll figure out who Tem is later. Maybe this is Tem. Um... Play. Greater Doggy is not excited enough to play with. Oh god. How do we... <gasps> Beckham! Come here! Come here, boy! Come here, boy! Good boy! Hey! Greater Doggy is seeking affection. Pet, pet the dog. Good boy! Aww! Then it wakes up. It's so excited. Jesus. I'm so bad at these. Like, you're going to see my health suffer so much. It's patting the ground with its front paws. What did you find? What did you find, boy? Play. I make a snowball and a foot for the dog. Go get it. Go get it. Sorry about that. Now, dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Oh my god, again. You want some tender love and care. Pet the dog. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Your movement's slow. But you still haven't pet enough. Right. Oh my god, I died. <sighs> well, there's the first game over. You cannot give up just yet. Stubbs! Stay determined. I mean, of course. I think we've done it. Greater dog is content. Mercer, spare, spare. Oh, oh, he's a good boy. Oh, he's a good boy. I don't think that's how you walk away in armor, but you know what? Who am I to tell a good boy off? Good boy, good dog. Also, ouch. <laughs> Ouch in the most major of way. Oh, I guess we don't get the sands thing. Hello. What the hell? Um. Gift. It refuses your gift. How do I know it's not a trick? Oh, this way. Oh. Okay. Um. Let's try and actually check. Some teams decorated it as a... Oh, okay. Is this funny to you? No, 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 no. I'm going to undecorate you. Ow. Undecorate. You remove a stocking filled with chicken nuggets. Are you going to eat those? That's a little better. Oh, God. How was I supposed to know? Like... I guess I fate rests upon you. Stubbs, stay determined. Again, perfect name for this title. Non-dog related reasons. That's a little better. Oh God. Nope. Undecorate. You, you remove the lenticular bookmark of a smug team winking. That's a little better. Right, it's the middle one. Why did I move? Undecorate. You remove a childhood photograph of Snowdrake and his parent. A weight has been lifted. So problems have been taken away. Spare. Spare. We're out. We out. We done. Nice. Ooh. Hello. It's a door. Oh. 
Is the door open now? It's a door. Okay, so. Still a door. Still a door. Still a door. And still a door. Okay, I'm just going to leave it. I'm guessing there's a code, but we don't need 10 minutes of trying to get a code. We, we really don't. Say, are you following me? Sanj, you're the guy who seems to just do that. Are you sure you don't you do like to oh no you sure do like to exercise? <sighs> Sans, I'm gonna be real with you. No. Wee Very quickly save. Those are with determination. Right. Going on. And with me talking this much, hopefully, it keeps you entertained. Let's go again. So, pet. We're going to try and speed one this time. Right, and then blue. Really? Why does it... Just when I think I'm getting used to it, it changes just a little this bit. White. And see, how am I supposed to dodge that? Okay, got it. Pet capacity, pet again. Okay, we did it, we did it, we're done, we're done. Spare. I am, however, because I'm super paranoid that we're just going to die again, sprint back and save. But, um, yeah. I feel like having this as an outlet for me to try and get better at talking is fun. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, this game's fantastic. Like I'm loving the music straight away. There we go. Across we go. But I can't wait to see... Did I just mess up? Really? The tiniest bit and it's just like, no. But I can't wait to see what the rest of this has to offer. Because, um, again, another little uh, tidbit. This game's eight years old. The fact that I've managed to stay basically spoiler free is kind of insane. I mean, I know these this, I know this Delta Rune, I believe it is, which is the second one. But um, I really wanted to play this for the longest time. I'm really enjoying it. Uh, you guys have been fantastic, even just watching it. But let's get back into the talking, shall we? Human. This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the Gauntlet of Deadly Terror. Why? Oh, look, a little dog. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will sing, blades they will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. So what's the dog for? Well, what's a hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. No, seriously, what's the dog for? That um doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are ex expertly cooked. But this method is too direct, no class at all. Away it goes! You lost a button, didn't you? Phew! What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Eh? Eh? Um... Fair enough, I guess. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Well, luckily we've got enough health. Um, welcome to Snowden Town. Oh, finally a shop. Hello, traveller. How can I help you? A uh, tough glove, manly bandana... So plus two attack, we don't need that. Plus four defense. 
Um, heals 11 HP times 2. Eat it twice. Well, first we're getting that. Yes. Um, buy one of them. Buy one of them. Buy another one of them. Um, sell. Huh? Sell something? Does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Finally! Someone in a game that actually tells you why are you trying to give me crap. Anyway, talk. Care to chat? Say hello. Hiya! Welcome to Snowden. Can't remember last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? What is there to do here? You want to know what to do? Grub is his food, and the library is information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister wants it. And if you're really bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. It's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Okay, what about the town history then? Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head to the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folks decided they liked the cold and set up camping Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages. So unless you're a ghost, I can borrow under the door. Forget about it. What about your life? Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic. But we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth, face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Well, thank you very much. Goodbye for now. Come again sometime. Well, you gave me health, which was great. Um... You gave me a manly bandana. Armor plus seven. Yeah, somewhere it has abs drawn on it. So we'll use that. You equip the manly bandana. Um, use the box? Yes. We'll put the snowman piece away because I don't want to eat it. Just, just in case. Don't need the faded ribbon. Um, don't need the monster candy. We'll keep the ice cream, we'll keep that, we'll keep the cinnamon and we'll keep that. Suck about a little bit. Don't want to walk to the other side of town? Charlie, under snow tunnels, they're efficiently laid out. I like this music, it's calm. Hello. Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its trees like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. You guys invented Christmas. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bum buns are so adorable. Hee <laughs> hee. Wait a minute. Cinnamon bunny. A cinnamon but Oh, thank God. <laughs> I was thinking then. It's like, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. So she's a rabbit person. And she has a pet rabbit? How does that work? That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Yeah, she's got a pet rabbit on a leash while she's a rabbit. I can see why she disturbs you, my guy. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. I mean... It, I guess? It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. Yeah, Christmas! Wow. Um, let's quickly check out the inn. Mum says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? Welcome to the Snowdin. Snowdin's premier hotel. One night is 80G. We have 89. Should we do it? 
Um, you know what? Let's do it. Here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up. I just sleep on my face, I guess. <laughs> wow, those guys are loud. Are they singing? They're actually singing. I would not be able to sleep if that was my room. I don't even know what I would do. Hiya! You look like you had a great sleep. Which is incredible because you were the only one up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Oh, well, oh wow! 30 HP! And I got my money back. That's um... That's fantastic. But... Since over there seems like it's going to be a lot of progress and it seems like it will get me kind of um, stuck, I guess, in a progression sort of way. As always, the sign outside such a friendly town fills you with determination. We shall save. No, I don't want to go through that cutscene. But anyway, hello, how are you? I hope you're doing well. Um, do you know how hard it is to not try and look up spoilers for this game? Like, because I've been, obviously, you know, playing this game and uploading it all to YouTube, to TikTok, and then the thumbnails over on Instagram, everything's became Undertale-related now, so it'll be like, oh yeah, I'm creating this Undertale cosplay, or this is my playthrough, or I'm doing the, the other routes of this playthrough, or the game's not that hard, and so on and so forth, and it's... It, it's very tempting to just try and watch it all, but obviously I want to play this with you guys and girls and, you know, everyone else who watches. So I can't, it, it's, I can't help but want to see the spoilers, but I know it will ruin the genuine experience between me and you. This town doesn't have a mayor, but if there's a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. So there's a fish lady somewhere? Um, everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm not very funny. Same, same. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything. So why be morose about it? You know what? That's a that's a nice way of looking at it. Oh, slight update, which um, I'm finding very, very, very nice. And I have to give a massive, massive, massive thank you to everyone who's subscribed, who's viewed, who's liked. We unlocked the community tab on YouTube. Now, I was reading through it, and it says it takes up to two months for that to happen, but we got it within our first month. Like, by the time this recording comes out, the community tab will be maybe about two, three days old, which is amazing to me, because looking back, when I first started uploading the shorts, I didn't think I'd get to this point so quick. So again, massive thank you to you all, to everyone who's watched, everyone who's liked, commented, shared the video, the new subscribers, the old, you are fantastic. And now that we've got the sappiness out of the way, let's go into Groby's. Kind of hungry. Wow. Wait, so this is where that music comes from. This is like, you know, TikTok generic sound 101 when you don't know what to put on your, <laughs> on your video. I think I've used this sound. Well, at least we know where it's from. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and hot guys. That dude's literally on fire, my guy. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. If those skeletons throw you a bone, they'll fall apart. You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. 
and he is the best of boys. Now, if you've watched the previous episode, he's also the strongest of boys. I think I died to him maybe three times or something. I'm thinking of getting a spiked collar to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, Attach a leash to me, a leash, I mean, and take me for a walk, please. That was not the statement I was thinking of, but okay. <gasps> Wait, what? I guess you don't talk then. Fair enough. What about you? Do you talk? Hmm. Isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. Okay. <laughs> the capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip on their butts. Oh, as someone who's from a small area, it's pretty funny. <laughs> Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. <laughs> Fair enough. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. Oh, it was you! I'm literally going to make out with a fish. I mean, there is a fish lady somewhere. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. <laughs> it appears to be losing. You know, that's the type of uh, that's the type of way I'd play that game. Ruby said that he offered you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. <laughs> I get it. I get it. I like you, Groby. It's pretty funny. I get it. You know, fire, water, gets on him, he'll be extinguished, blah, 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 blah. Ruining the joke by explaining it. You know how it goes. Ooh, the library. And a lot of mail. There's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labelled papyrus. Look inside? Yes. 70. I don't know what I expected. I really don't. Right. Let's actually check the library then, because I'm guessing that's Papyrus's house, and obviously Sans. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know the sign is misspelled. Is it? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Lib. Ra. B. My dyslexic ass read Latter's Library and I was fine. <laughs> I was absolutely fine, but no. Oh, okay. <laughs> that look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble. Oh my fucking god, how did she know? <laughs> That's literally the, the description of my previous episodes. I'm pretty sure I'm on the uh, puzzles, puzzles everywhere I put. I hope I can do Junior Jumble. <laughs> I love working on a newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it in with comics and games. Oh, nice. <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Um, when I was younger, story time, uh, I actually, well, I don't have them anymore. I used to colour the left side of my book because it was full of squares. So I'd do my work on the right side, be bored as hell for 45 minutes, and colour in the left side. They should have figured out how, I, how artistic I was from that, but no. <laughs> <laughs> Still, I let I read that as library, not library. <laughs> that is way too funny. Oh, 
Look at that fancy rock. Let's play Monsters and Humans. Okay. Never mind then. Ah! To be young again. The world sure felt boundless. Who are you? You're not going to make me be the human again, are you? Okay. Oh, what are you doing? And there it goes. So that's what that sound was. Fair enough, fair enough. Fair enough. Off we go. Should we go see Sans and Papyrus first before we go up there? How far can we go? Yeah, that seems like we're going in. Oh look, there it is! Goodbye, little guy. It's locked from the inside. It's locked. Okay, I guess we're not seeing Sans and Papyrus. But... Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Yeah, we'll go left. Just like mazes, I always go left. What about you? Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patience rewards me. Ah. Okay, I'm not going to do that anymore because I feel like I'll accidentally annoy them. Oh, bing bing. Hello? Can I speak to G? Wait a second. Is this the wrong number? Oh, it's the wrong number! The wrong number song! Alright, let me see if I can sing this. I am horrible, by the way. One sec. We're very, very sorry that we got it wrong. Oh, it's the wrong number, the number wrong song. We're very, very sorry that we got it wrong. Click. Pretty sure I've got the lyrics wrong, even though they were on screen. <laughs> That's kind of cool. We're very, very sorry that we got it wrong. This is the wrong number song. I bet if I go on YouTube, I can find someone who's remixed that immediately. But I guess we're going this way. Oh, we're getting a change in the scenery. Let's go. That's too much of a change in scenery. Who could that figure be? Human! <laughs> Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like... The joy of finding another pasta lover. The admiration for another puzzle solving skills. The desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings... They must be what you are feeling right now! How did he know? How did he know? I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am the very great. I don't even wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not. You shall be lonely no longer. I, the great Papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human! I must capture you! Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream! Powerful, popular, prestigious! That's Papyrus! The newest member of the Royal Guard! So we're not friends? I love this song so much. Like, I kid you not that I've made this my alarm so I can wake up to it. Come on, Papyrus! Let's check you out. 20 attack, 20 defense. He likes to say, Nyeh. <laughs> Should we flirt with him? What? Flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Well, I am a skeleton with very high standards. Well, I have zero redeeming qualities. Oh no! My humility! It reminds me of myself. You're meeting all my standards. Let's date later after I capture you. He's thinking about what to wear for his date. Let's flirt again, shall we? Oh no! 
Let's take later after I capture you. What to cook for his date? Flirt again, shall we? You flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting won't escalate this battle. Oh, okay. Shall I just try mercy then? I'm just going to try mercy. Spare. So you won't fight. Then, let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. Cheers, Sans. I appreciate this. Oh, shit. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> You're blue now. Well, let me flirt with you again. He's too busy fighting to flirt back. After I capture you. Alley up. Alley up. What? Big jumps. Papyrus dabs. <laughs> he dabs. Mitt brand bishy cream behind his ear. Wait, he has ears? I'm just gonna spare you. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. Uh, watch me dodge all of your attacks because I'm really awesome. Big jump! Big jump! Oh, ho, 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 ho. I'm gonna spare you again. You don't make me use my special attack. Oh god. Whoa, big jump. Ha 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 ha, I'm getting better at this game. Cute juice behind his ear. How much are you dabbing, my guy? Like, that was. It was tasteful for 2017, but we're 2023 now. I can almost taste my future popularity. You will never catch me, Papyrus. Oh god. It's a good thing I started going back to the middle. Let's try and flirt again, shall we? He's too busy fighting to flirt back. Papyrus, head of the Royal Guard. Alley up. I like his attack, it's very cool. It's a bit. Why is he putting yogurt behind his ears? It's a bit different. Papyrus unparalleled spaghetti. Do, 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 do. Oh god. Ha 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 ha. Why did I. He realizes he doesn't have ears. Finally. Well, I'm gonna eat my nice cream papyrus. I'm super spiffy. My HP was maxed out. Undying will be really proud of me. Oh, big jump. Oh god. Yeah, I need to use the D-pad. I've been using the thumbstick and yet again, because I know, yet again, I am bad with the thumbstick. Papyrus is trying to act it cool. Oh, he's trying too hard to play cool. But let's spare you. The king will trill a hedge in the shape of my smile. Valley up. Oh, if I just do this. Let's see if you can flirt with him again. He's too busy fighting to flirt. My brother, well, he won't change. He remembered a bad joke Sans told him, and is frowning. I'll spare. I have lots of admirers, but... Oh, it's getting higher. Can you sound bad at these games? You eat one half of the... <laughs> of the bicycle. Well, anyone like me, as sincerely as you. Yep. Up. Oh god, that's new. Do, 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 do. Someone like you is really rare. Like that Pokemon that's supposed to be hard to catch. Ooh. He whispers. Yeah. <laughs> 
Dating might be kind of hard. I'm kind of hard. He's preparing a bone attack. After you're captured and sent away, I will be in the royal guard. <laughs> oh god. He's valoring his bones. <laughs> Ugh, who cares? Give up. I'm gonna eat the other half of my unicycle. <laughs> nice. Unicycle, I get it. Give up, I'll face my special attack. Oof. Oh god. I really need to cough. <coughs> Sorry about that. Mercy. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. He doesn't have a special attack. To be fair, he's kind of beating me up without it. I would have already... There it goes again. I thought wearing the uh, new, new bandana would, you know, help me with defence, but I'm still losing three. Not too long and I will use that special attack. Oh my god, I give up. I'm so bad at this. Is there any way to make this easier? Jesus. <laughs> Jump. 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 He's trying real hard to play cool. Let me just float with you again. He's too busy fighting to float back. Behold my special attack! Oh. What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog. Will I get hurt? Oh, I have to press X. Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, what are you, what are you doing? Come back here and give me back my special attack. Oh, well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. <laughs> He's getting ready for a regular attack. Here's an absolutely normal attack. Well, it's working. It's really working, Jesus. Oh my god, the dog's back. Oh, cool. Dude. No. <laughs> no. Oh wow, go, 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 go! Go! <laughs> that was completely by accident. Oh no! Nailed it. I've only got two health, so I cannot be getting cocky here. Well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you. Give me a minute. I can see you. I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great papyrus, elect Grant your pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy.